This one, the fans are extremely light, they're very thin, plastic clothes, quite bendy. Now if they bash it really hard, often don't know it. Oh, so there's the DVI connectors, which I will promptly remove now. Ooh, there's a little tiny HDMI, I think. Is that the HDMI? God, it's tiny. There's yeah, a mini HDMI. I also read this is running, going to run 3D, 3D output. So I'll okay, so after um, trying to find a hammer for my tool clip, I got it in. Actually, very easy. Um, fit it in, perfect. Just slide it straight into the blue connector straight away, just went click. And um, the outside, a bit different to the other one. So the other one um, only had, it took up one row. This one takes a second row for the cool, cooling. Hmm, so I'm expecting great things in this. So I'll just check the cooling setup. So cooling goes through here. It's obviously sucking stuff from underneath as well. I'm just cooling it through here, but I'm just checking there's no obstructions. There's nothing really going to stop the air from throwing, um, flying around there. Maybe this little bit here is causing problems. You purists would probably tell me to cut this much more. But I can't be bothered. I'm only doing some minor um, updates, not the whole overclocking setup. So I'm just doing a last thing. Everything's in. Connected. That's connected. Power. Oh, good job I checked. Power for the graphics card. So these here they are here. So I'm going to keep, connect them just up to the back here. So, just sitting down like the cap. so here we see the fruits of my labour. Uh, after installing it all, they're looking about a uh, average of about 55 to 60 frames per second with the CRG at uh, Lesser Salamanca. Um, so yeah, I'm wrapped. It's just so much more fluid. And here's my test on the um, FPS for the uh, night. Uh, I find X Planes really punishes FPS at night time for some reason with all of the high contrast graphics and um, smoother than anything. About 45 FPS. Really lovely. Just makes a just makes a flying feel that much better with having a higher FPS. Been able to up the settings uh, to close to maximum now, at least very close. And then the SSD is just blindingly quick. So Sony Vegas, almost instant. Wham! Pretty big file loading there. It's hard to keep up sometimes. You've got iTunes. I've moved iTunes over to the S drive, I call it. Not the music yet, of course. Um, Chrome, which is a great search engine, amazing. It's even faster now. Picasa, instant. Google Earth, very quick. And then finally, uh, we'll load up SketchUp as well, over here. It's pretty well instant as well, so yeah, the SSD's a, a real benefit there. And finally, I uh, couldn't resist um, putting the whole of A10C onto the uh, SSD. Loads up much quicker. Comes at about 40 to 55 FPS, even with the high dynamic range set to uh, soft see the uh, shadows and uh, yeah I'm really pleased with how this is running now it's, it's very smooth not too much uh, lagginess or uh, stutters but yeah I hope you enjoyed it see you later bye